Hello students, welcome to our channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about coal base reaction. In our channel, we are providing handwritten notes for every topic which we have explained. And if you want to download handwritten notes for this topic, you just go and check out the description or else comment section where I have given link to download PDF for this topic notes. So now let's move on to the topic. Coal base reaction. So now let us understand the definition of it. The electrophilic substitution reaction between phenoxide ion and carbon dioxide to give orthohydroxy benzoic acid is called coal base reaction. So basically phenoxide ion is obtained from phenol. So we can consider a phenol molecule. So this is a phenol molecule. If suppose we are treating it with NaOH then the product that we obtained here is phenoxide ion that is sodium phenoxide ion therefore in presence of carbon dioxide in acidic condition that is in the presence of H plus the product that we could obtain so here it is this is ONA it will turn into OH while this CO2 it will basically add in the phenoxide ion and therefore we could get COOH so this is the product that we have obtained over here. So the name of this product is nothing but 2-hydroxy benzoic acid. And this is also commonly known as salicylolic acid. So this is nothing but coal based reaction. And this is how basically this phenoxide ion or the sodium phenoxide ion plays a very important role. And because of which it can react with carbon dioxide in an acidic condition. So it has to give us orthohydroxy benzoic acid. Now let us see the mechanism of this reaction. So firstly look at here we know that sodium hydroxide is a base and now you can see the proton which is present on this phenol will be removed by attacking onto the OH- like this. So by that you can get sodium phenoxide in which positive charge lies on the sodium atom and the negative charge on the oxygen atom. In this sodium phenoxide ion, resonance stabilized by the movement of negative charge from there to here and also the pi electrons from there to here. So we will get this structure and here you can see there is a negative charge on this C atom. So on the comparison of these two structures, we will see that this negatively charged carbon is more nucleophilic than the this negatively charged oxygen atom. So that's why this structure will act as a nucleophile and it will attack on the electrophile so which is CO2. CO2 is an electrophile here. So it is actually a weak electrophile. So in this CO2 molecule these pi electrons are shifted to oxygen atom and due to the higher electronegativity of this oxygen atom electron density will decrease on this carbon atom so it will act as an electrophile and it is attacked by this nucleophile and the sigma bond will form between this carbon atom and this carbon atom and now we will get this structure so here this ketone form is converted into phenol form by moving these sigma electrons of carbon and hydrogen bond and these pi electrons are shifted to oxygen atom and now we will get this structure. So in final step acidification occurs so that we will get orthohydroxy benzoic acid so which is also called as salicylolic acid. So this is all about the mechanism of coal base reaction. So it is very simple mechanism and here the electrophilic aromatic substitution mechanism is followed because electrophile is substituted on this ortho position of this aromatic system.